If I'm gonna have a cheat meal, I have to smack a KFC and just crush some fried chicken. What's up guys, I'm Louis Tan and Men's Health is asking me what I like to eat. I have a crazy schedule, I have a crazy travel schedule, I have a crazy work schedule. My philosophy behind my diet is to feel what my body wants and needs and give it exactly that, no more, no less. Of course, there's, there's exceptions. There's <laughs> you know, I do action movies, so, so when I'm filming action movies, I know what I need to eat, I know what I can't eat. I don't indulge because I'm eating strictly for fuel. So I eat chicken breast, broccoli, brown rice, fish, broccoli, brown rice, every day, all day. Right now, I just finished a pretty brutal workout, so I'm hungry. I like that feeling of being hungry a little bit. Usually, I'll do a workout on an empty stomach and some black coffee. I don't know how, how that's bad or not. <laughs> Favorite protein would be, I love elk. I love wild elk. It's super clean. You can find it usually from New Zealand is where I get a lot of it. Yeah, it's wild. It's running around in the forest drinking river water and then boom. It's a very, very clean protein. You'll feel great after you eat it. The healthy lifestyle to me is more about recovery, sleep, I do a lot of meditation. I do a lot of cold showers. I do a lot of ice baths. CBD and vitamins and supplements, magnesium, zinc, D3, fish oil, that's crucial. I'm traveling all the time. In the last three weeks, I was in four different countries across the world. If I don't keep my inner peace, then my external body is gonna feel that, you know what I mean? So not to get all like woo woo. My workouts are more martial art based. I perform all my own fight scenes myself in everything that I've done. I'm proud of that. It's something that's a part of my family's legacy. My father is a fight choreographer. I've been growing up around the stunt industry my whole life. I want to bring that to my work. So I'm 6'3", 190 pounds. If I get heavier than that, I'm slow. So when I train, I train mitt work, bag work, rounds, sparring, choreography weighted vest training, uh, cables, light weights, and Muay Thai boxing for 15 rounds. Drastically changed my eating habits like Christian Bale and the Machinist type of thing? <laughs> Not yet. So I have a TV series that's out now, Shadow and Bone on Netflix, and for that character, Tolia, they reference him as like a giant. I tried to do some workouts that were a little more heavy weights, less reps, so I can gain a little bit of size. I wanted to have like bigger shoulders and like a little bit of a bigger kind of like huskier look. He's always eating. If you see my scenes in that show, I'm tr I try to eat in almost every scene, sometimes to my detriment. <laughs> if I'm gonna have a cheat meal, once in a while, I have to smack a KFC and just crush some fried chicken. I'm getting hungry, you guys are killing me with all these questions. Now. Life is about balance. It's about balancing your life and feeling the best for your body. Everybody's different. I love good wine. I'm not gonna shy away from uh, having a nice glass of wine with my meal. I like to enjoy my life, but I like to stay fit too. So it's finding that balance. Two cups of coffee is my limit. I like to do that before 12 p.m. Any more than that. I'm wired up and I'm on one and who knows what's gonna happen. Last meal I cooked. Ooh, geez. <laughs> I don't cook that often for people. I can make really nice like elk tacos with some chopped up onions and garlic, spicy mango sauce, and just keep it really clean. Maybe put a little bit of Parmesan cheese, just not too, not too much. And uh, yeah, some nice elk tacos. <laughs> Probably just a great A5 Wagyu steak with some dim sum, and then I'd have like a Korean barbecue set up, some like nice wine, and then send it all the way with a nice creme brulee. All right, well, I ran through all the food. Now I'm starving, and now I am dreaming about food, so I gotta go check out Shadow and Bone on Netflix right now and go grab yourself something to eat.